Welcome to another edition to the Assassin's Sports Show and much more, guys. Thank you for the love, appreciation you bring each and every day. Y'all are the face that run the place. I cannot do the show without you guys. Thank you for the likes. Thank you for the shares. Thank you for y'all comments. Y'all just been amazing with y'all comments. Guys, thank you for everything and the support. Y'all been amazing. I got the best fans in the world. Because, I mean, and I say world because y'all from every other place, man. It's just been amazing. So, thank you so much for supporting this show. So guys, plus guys, if you're passing by the YouTube channel, if you like what you see, you hit that subscribe button, become a size two, they guarantee, man. And I'm gonna tell you what, I was one of y'all. I went to different channels, different YouTube station, and and they didn't care about your opinions on anybody else. They didn't care about my opinions, they didn't care about nobody else's opinion because they thought their opinion was gospel, and that's it because they got inside sources. Let me tell you about size, let me tell you about the inside sources, guys. Don't mean crap to me, because they're human beings. And they like a player and they're gonna sugarcoat it. And that's it. That's the inside sources. Don't mean crap to me. So, I made this channel for the fans because it's a uniqueness to y'all. Y'all see y'all team and y'all vision and how y'all see it, who y'all wanna build around with. And that's what makes this channel different than any other channel because it's all about y'all. When I say y'all the face that run the place, I mean it. It's all about y'all. So, guys, if you like this kind of show, if you think it's for you, guess what? You hit that subscribe button and become an assessor today. So let's talk about the Miami Marlins, guys. Miami Marlins, incredible win today, five to nothing. But it comes with a cost, right? Um, Jose Arena got hit by the ball, uh, fracturing his arm. He's out of the playoffs, guys. I mean, I feel so, so sorry for that kid because that kid was pitching his heart, his heart out. And for him to not even go to the postseason this and, and and why my heart goes out to him because this kid been to the rough patches with this fr franchise losing season after losing season after losing season for him not to show show to the playoff to even go to the playoffs and 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 contribute to the playoffs it's just hard it's just heartbreaking so guys if y'all could do one favor for me i, could, I know i got great fans great assassins Go out and reach out to Jose Arena and just reach out to him and say, you know what, man, we appreciate you. Because that means a lot to players that you reach out to them, believe it or not. They're human beings and they want to be reached out to. So that and then Stony Monte got hit by a pitch, 95 miles per hour. Um, but we dodged that bullet. He's OK. Just they just took him out for precautionary reason. And but it, he's going to be sore. Um, so I think he'll be fine. After two days, he'll be fine. He's he's gonna be fine. Um, like I said, Jazz Chisholm, man, he he was doing it from the field, from the bat. He had a great day. I mean, he had a homer, a double. So that kid is coming alive. You can see this morning team's coming alive. And I'm gonna say something. And I've been so far some right. This sounds to me like the two 2003 for, um, for the Marlins. Me and the Miami Marlins now. But this team is like similar. They fight hard. They go against everybody. And I love what Chisholm say, why not us? You know, we ain't gonna be shocked if we win it all. Why not us? And, and that's the attitude. You got to believe in that dugout. You have to believe in that locker room. If you don't, then you're in the wrong business. As, as people in the media might not believe in you or people and fans don't believe in you, but you have to believe in yourself. You have to go out and perform. Because you never know in the postseason, one, one, one error here, two errors here, there, and you win the next round. You never know what happens. So that's what I'm saying. You, you never know. So I love that spirit. I love that fight with that kid. And guys, just that fight. That man, Lee, my has, like I said, he's coach of the year for me. What he has done with this team, it's just amazing. They are gonna face the Cubs. Um. Like I said, it sounds like 0-3 to me again, facing the Cubs. Um, man. And I don't think the Cubs are that great of a team right now. So you could beat them up a little bit. We have not faced them, but they have not faced us. So you got Rodgers, Sixto. I think Sixto's gonna go first game. Then you got Rodgers and then and then and then you got Pablo. So then and then I don't know who's gonna be your your fourth. Cause it was gonna be a rain, yeah, but you you don't know. So it's hey, remember the the first playoff is three games. Whoever wins three games wins. So we gotta face the Cubs. So great. That's 
it just sounds like a 0-3, 3 man, all over again. And they got good pitching. They got good bullpen right now. So the starting pitching could go, let me tell you something. If the starting pitching could go seven innings and give that man seven innings, watch out for this team. Watch out. Six year they got to work with him. I think in the off days, they're gonna be starting working with him, showing what he's done. Cause remember, Marlins have not had an off day, so they couldn't work with him, what he's been doing, really putting on. I think they're gonna put, um, they're gonna take every guy and, and say, listen, this is what you have to do if they jump on you, whatever. So I think I think that's a great feeling. So the Marlins will play on Wednesday. I don't know what time it, what time it, it could be daytime, nighttime, I don't know yet. But um they are gonna play the Cubs on Wednesday. So just just amazing. Just amazing what this team has accomplished. But they're not done yet. And I'm gonna say here, and remember this is the only show that has has said what I said, and I stand by what I said. Marlins will win the World Series. Book it, earn it, and respect Miami. They won't win the World Series. Why I say that? Because they are a team, and it's hard to beat a team. It, this is a team. This is not selfishness. This is a team. So I think this team is, is geared for the long run. And watch out. And I'm telling you, watch out again and again and again and again. Because this, remember, there was the local when they won the championship. And that's what we're going to be doing, winning the chip. We're going to be winning the chip, baby. So remember... It's all about Miami. It's not Florida Marlins, it's Miami Marlins. And take this note, we have never lost a series in the postseason. So they got history behind them. So can you imagine Marlins go in, three championship, and, and every time they go into the postseason, they win three. They win championships. That's what we do in Miami, we win championships. We don't care how we get in, but we get in, we win championships. And finally, they have a winning record. 17 years, and they got a winning worker, man. Just amazing by them. Thank God that this team is motivated, and I can't wait to see this team. Just can't wait what they do in the postseason. It's going to be special. Remember what I said. Minus in the World Series. They will win the World Series. So, guys, that's my show. Thank you for supporting it. Thank you for everything that y'all provide for me. So, thank you, guys. God bless.